Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to show you guys some great tools I found out about in Blender for taking your mesh and cleaning it up without having to do manual processes. Um, so you can see inside my mesh I have some of these floating vertices here, and normally you can kind of just hit L, hide everything, and go ahead and manually delete them all across your mesh, but there's an even easier way to do uh, that and things similar to that. So if you're in edit mode and you have your mesh entirely selected, you can hit A for that. Uh, go to the mesh menu and clean up, and there's some really good tools in here, including delete loose, which will get rid of vertices, edges, or faces that aren't connected to anything, so I'm going to do that. And those vertices that were floating in there are now gone. Uh, also, in the same menu, you have, uh, I think it's degenerative, uh, degenerate dissolve which if you have any faces or zero length edges, basically um, unnecessary data in there that's not affecting your mesh in any way, you can get rid of that too. So you can see here, got rid of four edges and four faces. And in the same menu, um, there's also fill holes. So if you have holes in your mesh, you can go ahead and click that. Let's actually, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's delete a face and see how that works out. Okay, so we have this empty face here. You can kind of see it. Um, let's go to Mesh, Clean Up, Fill Holes. Okay, it worked perfectly. So, awesome. If you have holes in your mesh, floating vertices, or zero length edges or faces, those tools I'm sure are going to be really useful for you. Uh, previously, I was looking for them outside of Blender, but, you know, Blender over the years has gotten pretty decent. So, um, yeah, hopefully those tools help you out. You don't have to do things manually anymore. Just get rid of vertices the easy way using that cleanup menu. Uh, once again, it's in edit mode. Then you click on mesh down here in the 3D viewport, clean up, and pick the tool of your choice. So I've been Chris. I hope this helps some of you guys out there, and I will see you guys in my future video content.